Hey guys, today I wanted to talk to you about Remote Expert with Cisco Mobile Advisor. So for anyone that doesn't know what Remote Expert is, um, it's pretty self-explanatory. It's getting in touch with an expert that's remote, so someone that's not standing next to you. Um, some of the use cases for this could be in banking, where let's say you walk into a branch and the mortgage specialist isn't there that day. Um, you might be remote at another location. It'd be nice to go into a, a quiet area with maybe a DX... Uh, 80 or DX70, one of the personal endpoint units there, push a button on the screen and talk to an expert remotely. Um, you can use it with the mobile advisor, which I'm going to show here today as well, where it can be built into an application, uh, again, on a retail front. So if someone's looking at your web page, looking to buy something um, on their iPad, again, they can hit a button and they can video dial, uh, they can video dial an expert to go over what's, what's new. Um, there's also kiosks that we can build this stuff into. Uh, so that's basically what Mobile Advisor is. And I'll jump into a little bit of a demo here so we can, so I can actually show it to you guys. So right here, um, I have an iPad. I'm using the app Reflector so you guys can see it on my Mac so I can record this here. And I have a user that's looking at Cisco.com. It looks like they're, they're looking at some different phone models here. And you can see on the right side, let links inside of our web page here. And this goes toward that full omni-channel type of experience where, you know, how can we help you basically? Do you want to do a web chat with us? Do you want to send in an email if you have questions about these phones? Maybe you want to find a Cisco reseller that's in your area. Maybe you want to call us. Um, and then again, here's the new thing that we're going to be talking about the mobile advisor. So let's contact a live video agent. So my user here is going to go ahead and they're going to push that. And it's going to connect them to a remote advisor. So they should be connected and you can see that the remote advisor popped up on their screen and it's actually me. If I go over to my Finesse desktop, part of the contact center, we can see, we can take a look who actually called in here. So you can see, oh, we got Mr. Claus over here. A little early for him, but I guess he's calling in. He's looking at some Cisco phones, maybe, maybe for Christmas present for somebody. So I could greet Mr. Claus, and I could say, so Santa, looks like you're looking at some different phones. And maybe Santa's not really sure which phones uh, he should be looking at. Um, as part of my cockpit here, I could do a couple things with Santa. I could point some stuff out. So maybe Santa's looking at the 8800 series phones and the 8900 series phones, and he's not sure which one to click on. You know, I could direct him and say, well, why don't we take a look at first the 8800 series phones, and I can actually draw and mark up the screen here. And I'll show you what that looks like on the iPad as well. So you can see here in the iPad, I just highlighted the 8800 series phones, and we could go in there and we could take a look at those. So maybe on the iPad now, I'll go in and I can click on it. And I'll just hop back over to here. And I can, I can hit that trash can button there and it actually deletes the red that I put on there. Or if I want to click it myself here, I have the option of doing it and I can actually direct them through the web page just like that. So... That's kind of it, just a real quick um, example of what Mobile Advisor is. And I did show you guys, again, on the iPad application. Um, you could build this into your application. So, you know, if you were Bank of America and you had your own banking app, you could build in Mobile Advisor right to that. You can have it just as a link on your web page. They click the button, they get fed into the contact center. Um, and again, it can be used for any company that has a web page that wants to provide more help and provide video. It could be used in retail type situations, it could be used in banking type situations. And it's quick, it's easy, it's another great way to provide support for your customer base that's calling in. Um, and then when you're done, you can either hang up on the person or the person can hang up just by clicking end call here at the bottom and I'll end the call here or there so you guys can take a look at that. Um, the good part of this is, as well is if you are a Cisco Contact Center agent or a Cisco Contact Center customer, um, it all links together so we can track if they came in over video, if they came in over a chat, if they, if they called in, and we can put all that stuff together. So that's it. Thanks, guys.